what's up everyone welcome back to Mass Effect 2 modded uh, today we are um, doing Thane's recruitment quest and I think it's time to uh, say why Thane is the last one uh, because I wanted to get the um, shadow broker done because uh, that's the last interaction that I will have with Liara and I kept her romance uh, uh, intact and now I'm gonna romance Thane for Mass Effect 2 at least and uh, yeah that should be um, a good way to uh, get uh, Liara out of the picture without having her like you know do shadow broker right when I have the romance going on with with Thane so this way she kinda doesn't know she will know in Mass Effect 3 but not in Mass Effect 2 uh, so the interactions are, are a little bit different or better like we did already so let's go to uh, Ilium uh, we might yeah, I'm gonna... Yeah, we can explore the areas later. I'll probably do it anyway off-camera because it's just um, the planet, so... Not really that interesting. Let's go here. And then we're gonna move over to Ilium. I still don't know when the um, collector ship mission is. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, when the collector ship mission is um, triggering. I think it's some missions after Horizon, but I'm not sure how our Shadow Broker counts into this one. So I'm pretty sure we can do uh, this one for sure, obviously. And uh, I think I'm gonna go with Morden because I haven't really had him in the team yet, I think. And I'm not sure if I had Shaq with me, actually. At least teammate. Did I? Yeah, I'm not sure. It's been a while since I played, so... Uh, well, we, we gave her skills, so... I guess we had her somewhere. Uh, let's do Shockwave. Uh, something about a train. Mm, might as well go improved shockwave because it gives a wider impact radius. The force isn't really that important, I would say. So we go uh, improved one. Uh, I'm gonna keep the points after her. Oh, actually, we don't need it for her. We can go pull. I got the barb ammo myself. Uh, more than... I'm pretty sure I didn't level with him yet. So that must be something else. Um, I really think... Incinerate is the, the better one, to be honest. Um, then I'm gonna wait for Concussive Shot to have it uh, maxed out. I'm not really using it that often, but you know. Matok is fine. Alright. Carnifex, Plasma, Cast, yep. Let's go. I maybe had them with me just on, on like missions like this, where we just run around. How 
How can you short sell on prefabs after these human colony attacks? They're going to see a ton of business. All right, I think. Actually, I'm wondering. No, um, Liara is no longer here, as far as I know. So this is a side quest here. I know the data is vital to the For the quest that we're doing anyway. So uh what's it that one? Serena? Who wants to know? Someone this question show some respect. Okay, we are ready to sure. Someone who can make your life a living hell. <laughs> Too late. Liara Tassoni said you'd have information on ah, okay. Bang Krios. Am I wasting my time? Tana, cover for me. Over here. Yeah, I know who Thane Krios is. I might have passed him some information, but I didn't hire him. What do you want to know? Mm. Talk fast. I just need to talk to him. Dangerous man to chat with. Your call, though. I ran security for Nasana Dantius. Then I found out she was having people killed to cover up her dirty secrets. She fired me when I confronted her. Her loss. I might have been good enough to stop Thane from taking her down. Investigate. If you work there, you must have an idea what his opposition will be. Eclipse Mercs. High-tech killer. Undisciplined, but very well equipped. They don't much care who they kill, as long as they're paid for it. Thane has quite a reception waiting for him. I told him all I knew. He didn't seem worried. All right. Why does that name sound familiar? She was a representative on the Citadel a few years ago. Right. Yep. She had me kill her sister, the slaver. I thought that was just a rumor. Well, you know what she's capable of then. She has even more power here in Nos Astra. She uses it to keep her friends in check and her enemies dead. That should be it, okay. So where do I find Thane? The Dantius Towers, penthouse level of Tower One. There's a second tower, still under construction. If Thane is smart, he'll go in from there. Uh... Okay. It doesn't sound like Nisana is just gonna let me in. She's as smart as she is paranoid. No one's getting in or out of there without a fight. I can get you in, but you'll only get one shot. You'd better be ready. Uh, sure. Do you know anything else about Thane? Not much. He did say that he's not doing the hit for money. Nobody hired him. I wanted to know who I was helping, and he said he's doing this job on his own. That he had to restore the balance of his life. I don't know. Maybe he's crazy. If he takes down Asana, I don't care why he does it. You're just offering your help. No strings attached. You're going to look for Thane. Nasana's mercenaries will try to stop you. At the least, you'll distract her guards. Take a little fire, give Thane a clear shot. I didn't hire him to kill Nasana, but I won't shed any tears when she gets what's coming to her. Uh, sure. Let's let's go then. Good. I'm tired of this crap. We'll go tonight as soon as the shift workers clear out of Tower Two. Tired of this crap. Okay, we can still select them, I and mean, we're keeping the team. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're good to go. The towers are heavily guarded and you'll find more resistance closer to the penthouse. So this assassin, you planning to stop him? I'm just here to make sure he survives. Hmm. There they are, the Dantius Towers. You'll have to get up to the second tower and cross the bridge to the penthouse. Her mercs will fight you every step, but it's your best chance. I'll see. We might find him before it goes that far. Maybe. At least you'll know where he's headed. Mm. All right, let's do this. Hold on.
Don't linger too long. They'll be here to greet you soon enough. Good luck, Shepard. Oh, I hate those little things. Interestingly, destroy you. Watch the landing. I have the uh, Oops. I have the um, ammunition active. That's strange, but I mean it's okay. But I'm wondering why, because normally it doesn't stay over missions, it sometimes never even stays over uh, you know the weapon selection screen. Look inside here. All right. Ah, uh, we got lots of green and red. That was fast, at least. Okay. So we can talk to that... Uh, Salarian. Not that one. Uh, I mean, we could kill him because we're renegade, but... Uh, no, uh, I, I don't think I want that. Help. Still alive, but unstable. I can't feel my legs. My chest is killing me. You're lucky. Just be glad you're still breathing. What happened? We're just night workers. Nasana sent them after us. She sent the mechs to round us up, but we didn't hear. They just started shooting. They just attacked you? Yes. They were too slow. It was horrible. Everyone screaming. The mechs said there was no time. Nasana wanted us out of the way immediately. Then... <coughs> Dogs <laughs> needs medical attention, Commander. Okay. Here, that should ease the pain and keep you alive until help arrives. He doesn't know where the assassin is. Take your time. I think I'm better. Find the other workers, help them. I need to get up to the penthouse. Any suggestions? Take the service elevator to the upper floors. The bridge between the towers isn't finished, but if you're careful, watch out for the mercs. They're everywhere. Any idea how many mercs Nasana's got? A lot. Dozens of them are wandering around here all day. You'll find more the further up you go. Okay. Why would Nasana kill her own workers? To her, we're expendable. But I didn't realize she was that ruthless. My friends, co-workers, slaughtered. They were jumping off ledges to escape the dogs. Okay, let's go. I'll do what I can. Thank you. Let's get moving. Oh, okay. I always thought that um uh, uh, five. That we couldn't go like in there because now we we used up like a, a med pack that we could have used or get back instead of the credits. But, yeah, I mean, we will survive, hopefully. No! Uh, 
I forgot. Uh, so shockwave we can put here and incinerate we can put there. Let's do a shockwave here. Take you all. Nice one. It's actually a good area here for the for the shockwave. Oh, she's dead. Ouch. Let's get the shotgun out, I would say. Ah, we could do sniper attack. Uh, we don't need disruptor. Point. I think we got only one left. That guy. Kill that one. Oh, we got more. Okay. Because she's not up yet, so. Means we have more. I heard something. Oh, there we go. <clears throat> Just the thing to help. Damn. Ah, Got it. Targeting. Actually, pretty close, so. Backup systems engaged. System rerouting power. Backup systems engaged. Ooh. Last concussion shot. <laughs> Oh, I had to switch, damn it. Oh. Okay, she's back up. I mean, I could probably kill them alone, but I don't really want to waste uh, a med pack if it's not really necessary. Coming from here, yeah. Nothing can stand. In this case, we can go close combat.
If I get the dog to explode, that would be nice. Ah, bit too late. Bit too late. Come here. Collision proximity warning. <laughs> Collision proximity warning. Got that one. Nothing can stop it. Yeah, I need some ammo. That would be nice. Nothing here, though. Hey, I think he went in here. Okay, we're gonna keep that one. You go get him. You go. Get your ass in there, and the is not paying you to stand around. Fine. But I... Uh... Here he comes. Okay, we got quite some ammo there. So. Ooh, that's pretty close. Enjoy. I've got no shield like a toy. Just burn nicely. I'll kill you all. Doink. Ooh, that was a nice move. I'll kill you all. Deploying incineration tech. Gotcha. Nothing can stop me. Ooh, nice one. Not go. sure if we got him though. But we got a lot of ammunition there. Destroy you. Now we're littered with with ammunition. Before there was like nothing. Excuse me. Whoa. Ah, that was a miss. Nothing can stop me. I'll throw you like a toy. Nothing can stop me. Actually, switch to that one. Change weapons. Fly, bitch. Not difficult. Should burn nicely. I'll throw you like a 
like a toy. Uh, do the trick. Oh, okay. There's quite a lot of enemies. At least I got ammunition this time. Oh, I don't see them from here? Okay. Good boy. Right, consideration Whoa. tech. Ah. Let's get around them. Hello. If I die. Oh, she's down. I'm haunting you, Shepherd. <laughs> to burn nicely. I've destabilized them. Concentrate. Ah, impressive shot. Hostile forces have engaged. Not bad. Oh, shit. Shit. Damn. I think he has no more weapon. <laughs> Damn, a sneaky bastard. Very sneaky. Very sneaky indeed. But I think we've got them all now. Or at least not many left, let's say that one. Uh, actually, we left some medic kits uh, over there, so I'm gonna get back and grab them once we're done with those guys. Gotcha. Uh, Rerouting power. That guy's still there. Killed that one. Watch the landing. I can take you all. Oh, another one of those guys. Oh, of course now it's uh going incineration tech. Got you. Okay. So let's grab those uh, I think they're way over there. Just for the credits. Okay. Just for the credits.
So if I remember correctly, there is like a big group coming from the elevator. Once I activate it, so that's not activated right now. I think that's a weaker version of what I have, but I guess uh, I now have it. So red, green, and something. Red, that one. Uh, that one. No, oh, it's blue. So we now got the other sniper, I think, <clears throat> which is a little bit uh, weaker, I think. It has like three shots, but uh, yeah. I think it didn't buy the, the bypass module yet, but I don't really think I need Please, don't kill us. We'll go, we'll go. Hey, look, they're not Eclipse. You're here to help us, right? <laughs> okay, let's do neutral with those guys. It's okay to come out. Have you seen anyone suspicious who isn't a Merc? Well, whoever sealed us in here. When he found us, I thought we were dead, but he just closed the door and locked us in. Assassin helping potential witnesses. Odd. Assassin? Here for Nasana, I bet. She's got it coming. You treat people like this, it always comes back to bite you in the ass. I like the outfits. There definitely is something with uh, with the mods. They look more polished on the NPC Salerans. Uh, let's get more info. I need to get to Nasana's penthouse. What's the quickest way? Cargo elevator is the only way up right now. They're still working up top. Watch your step. Some of the walls aren't in, and it's a long way down. Cold, too. I hate working up there. Nasana's not exactly your favorite person. <laughs> She's a hard woman to work for. That's an understatement. She works as long hours, no overtime, and this is what you get in payment. She's unpleasant, to say the least. Okay, yeah, in that case we can be a little bit more aggressive. If you don't like the work, just leave. Easier said than done. What's stopping you? Our contract. We're stuck until the job's done. Quitting for any reason can be hazardous to your health. We hear that anyone who leaves early tends to disappear. Probably just a rumor. But who wants to find out for sure? Did you see the one who locked you in? Do you know where he might have gone? He's no Solarian, I can tell you that. But I've no idea where he went. Sorry. If he's after Nasana, he'll be heading to the upper levels. How many workers were in the tower? Are there many more of you? Not alive. We were lucky. Well, some got out before the dogs were sent in. Maybe a few are hiding somewhere. All right. Let's continue. I stay here too long. You should, should go. Be safe down <laughs> on the lower floors. I was just thinking the same thing. Let's go, everybody. I should go. You should go. Thank you. And tell your assassin to aim for her head, because she doesn't have a heart. Get moving. Uh, as much as I like this playthrough of Renegade, I really hate my face. <laughs> uh, I really... I have to check how far we are in with... Uh, um, Renegade. Okay, there's still a lot to go, but... Once I hit the top and I have everything fleshed out, I will... Definitely... Remove the scars. Uh, so, we need to get ready for that big thing. Uh, so, I'll probably let them come and then move way back over there so that I have a little bit better playing field. Just stand here and wait for them? Nope. I like a straight fight, but... Might suggest just cover. Yep. Have a pleasant day. We'll do just that. 
Uh, you guys can go. Trouble yeah, incoming. Indeed. Final hide. <laughs> Oh, she's already down. Let's see if they burn. Sending in the I think that's the same voice actor than... Uh, the I think that it's also Courtney. That's voicing that Eclipse Engineer. The only good thing about this sniper is that you can use more shots in the time lapse, but that's about it. I mean, it's not too bad. I, I'm, I might keep it till I get to the collectorship. Uh, so the question is, are the ammunition still laying around here? Yes, I don't mind taking some. Not sure if they are still there. Oh, yes they are. Okay, cool. But I think we got all of them <clears throat> now. Oops. There might be some left around here, but I. Uh, nice. At least some of them. assassin is and I might let you live if I knew that I wouldn't be wasting my time talking to you you're not one of Nasana's mercs who are you you got two ways down express or coach your choice look pal even if I knew where he was I wouldn't tell you not the answer I was looking for I've got nothing more to say to you if you shoot me my team's right through there oh, okay that's a new one <laughs> How about goodbye? <laughs> Damn, I can take notes from you, Shepard. That's a compliment, I guess. Ah, oh, damn, that was a nice one. So this one is, I think, the quest item? Yeah. <clears throat> He's all over the place. What do you mean? of him on multiple levels. We think he's traveling through the ducts. I'm not paying you to think. Just find him now. Okay, uh, I take it back. The, the sniper is not too bad in, um, in the time lapse or whatever it is. Mode. 
Adrenal in Rush or whatever it is. Takes a lot of ammunition though. Got her. So we're getting like ten or so, uh, ten ammunition from one clip. So we got 60 max. First we're gonna go in here. Are you guys all right in here? Get back! Get back! I'll shoot! This can end quick or painful. Your <laughs> choice. I don't want to hurt you, but I will. I said okay, get never mind. back. Okay. Hurt me? I hardly felt a thing. Tell on. Slow and easy. He's my brother. I just want to see if he's all right. Are you the ones who shot the Merc? Oh, uh, not that one. I've shot a lot of Mercs today, but I can't take credit for him. Then... Who did? You tell me. What happened? The Merc found us and shouted at us to move. We, we panicked, and he shouted more. I thought he was going to kill us, then his head just exploded. Telen picked up the Merc's gun, but we were too afraid to leave. Then you showed up. Clean shot. Very nice. <laughs> Very nice. Very nice. How safe is that bridge out there? The bridge is stable, but the wind's your real problem. If it doesn't throw you off, the Mercs will definitely try. There's a lot of them out there. I mean, the skill from Jack could I'm be looking for someone. Good Probably up there. the guy who killed this Merc. Talon thought he saw someone following us, but he's been a bit on edge. I haven't seen anyone but the Mercs. Well, now he's KO, but... Is the bridge the only way to the penthouse and the other tower? From here, yeah. It won't be easy. Mercs are patrolling the other side. Whatever Nasana's hiding from must be pretty scary. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. <laughs> so we had, I should go, you should go, and you should get out. There are still Mercs up here. You should get to the lower levels. No need to convince me. Tell him. Come on, get up. Can we go home now? Yeah, we're getting out of here. Thank you. I just smacked him a little bit. Okay, so we got... Uh, maybe we have some... Yeah. Make PDA. Green... Okay. That was it. <laughs> a lot of green. Should be this one. And lots of red. Uh, this one. Ooh, 6,000. Nice. <clears throat> I might go to Chuchanka next if... Yeah, I could probably buy some stuff once I'm... Uh... I mean, I have to go for um, the Melon quest anyway, but... Um... Not sure if I want to do that right now. It's about time! What's going on down there? I'm afraid your men aren't able to respond, Nasana. Damn it!
Wow, oh, okay. Should do the trick. Mm. Weakening their integrity. Ooh. I'll kill you. This burned nicely. Oh. Oh. Ouch, okay, that, come, that hit me. Okay, let's move over there. Direct organ trauma. Okay, at least we got some ammo over there. That's good. Power cells? Oh. Never mind. I mean, I could switch, but I'm kinda okay with the sniper. Nice one. Oh, we can do that. Takes a lot of shots with that one. Okay, gets the commando. Never mind. More HP on that one. Could go with that one, but I can take you off. Watch the landing. Collision proximity warning. <laughs> one. This'll break him down. Yeah, that was very close combat. Yeah, I'll definitely need the um... The sniper, because there are like, uh, I think, rocket launchers or something like that, if I remember correctly. Like, over there somewhere. Over there, I think. Uh... This should come in handy. I think that's one of the things we actually needed uh, for, the for the next upgrade. 12k, okay. Uh, we got blue in the middle and whatever. Uh, Lots of red. That one. Yay, 12k. That's a big chunk. I don't care what you do. No one gets across that bridge. Oh. Oh. Grab and cover. Just burn through any armor. Weakening oh. their integrity. Ouch. Ah. Incineration tech. Okay, we're gonna get 
And then we do this. Come on, dude. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Do it. Oh, no, I want to slam her over. Okay, never mind. <laughs> oh, she's down. That's why. <laughs> okay, so those are the things that I need to get eliminated. Wish I was standing downwind. What? Wish I was standing downwind? So, oh, she's still there. Deploying Okay, there they are. Got that one. Uh, let's try this. this burn through any armor. Deploying incineration tech. Still not enough, wow. There we go, with the last shot. What the hell are you waiting for? Just kill them! Okay, so she's back, and by she I mean Jack. Mind over matter. Oh I got all of them. I got like a three shot there. Got that one. What the hell am I paying you for? Oh, there's another one. I'm sending in reinforcements. Get down. Uh, weakening their integrity. Uh, I guess we can switch to pistol. Die! I'll tear you apart. you like a toy. Goodbye. This will bring no Ouch. Incineration yes, I'll tear you apart. Oh, she's she oh. still got the berry up. Okay. Just needing to help. Go, go, go. Got me. Okay. Impressive shot.
I don't think we have any ammo laying. I mean, we don't need the ammo. Uh, we're done. As far as I know. That should be the last one. Shepard, but you're dead. I got better. <laughs> and now you're here to kill me. Maybe I just missed you. Screw you, Shepard. <laughs> Charming as ever. I'm sure you find this all very ironic. First you take care of my sister, and now you're here for me. Well, you made it this far. Now what? I wouldn't waste time hunting you down, Nasana. What do you call this? You've practically destroyed my towers. I wasn't looking for you. What the hell are you talking about? Is it credits? Is that what you want? Just tell me your price. We can make this problem go away. How much do you have? Make me an offer. Double whatever you're getting. And I'll pay double again if you tell me who hired you. What? I heard something. Damn it. Check the other entrances. You. Stay put. When I'm finished dealing with this nuisance, you and I are going to... Lots of details in his face. Nice entrance. <laughs> I will stay a little bit more renegade till he's on the ship. I just tore this place apart looking for you. The least you can do is look at me. Praise for the wicked must never be forsaken. Nasana and her men deserve what they got. Not for her. For me. The measure of an individual can be difficult to discern by actions alone. Take you, for instance. All this destruction, chaos. I was curious to see how far you'd go to find me. Well, here I am. I do want to talk to you, but how did you know I was here? Gunfire and explosions. I prefer to work quietly. If I have to fight through guards, I've made a mistake. I rarely make mistakes. You disrupted my plan, but your distraction eventually proved valuable. Let's cut to the chase. I need you for a mission. Indeed. You're familiar with the Collectors? By reputation. They're abducting entire human colonies. Freedom's progress was their handiwork. I see. We're going after them. Attacking the Collectors would require passing through the Omega-4 Relay. No ship has ever returned from doing so. Ah, oh, so I've heard. They tell me <clears throat> it's a suicide mission. I intend to prove them wrong. A suicide mission? <laughs> yes, a suicide mission will do nicely. I'm dying. Low survival odds don't concern me. The abduction of your colonists does. Uh -huh. You're dying. Are you contagious? How long do you have? If you're interested, we can discuss it on your ship. The problem isn't contagious, and it won't affect my work. Not to look a gift assassin in the mouth, but why are human colonists a concern to you? They are innocent, yes? Like all victims of the Collectors. The universe is a dark place. I'm trying to make it brighter before I die. Many innocents died today. I wasn't fast enough, and they suffered. I must atone for that. 
I will work for you, Shepard. No charge. All right, so we gotta level up. Got a new sniper. We got the damage. I uh, think we found all of it, I guess. And we found some elements here. I've heard impressive stories, Krios. Sounds like you'll be an asset to the team. That is, if you're comfortable having an assassin watch your back. I've accepted a contract. My arm is Shepard's. Uh-huh. Don't know about you, but I'm loyal to more than my next paycheck. So, what I I heard was that uh, when the game was developed, that there was like, um... Like, backstories for the characters that uh, some of them, or... There was like, you know, that you have two of them that are fighting each other and you have to uh, make peace with them or something. And I think uh, Jacob and uh, Thane are the ones. Uh, it's not done in the game. Uh, I mean, you have it with um, with Jack and with uh, Miranda. But I heard it somewhere that like for everyone there was like a, like a banter going on. Like, for example, Morden with Grunt and something like that, because Genophage and, and whatnot. Uh, and, yeah, Jacob and, and Thane probably, because he's very aggressive without doing anything, and I think that was just left in. You're here because I need a good gun. Cross me and we got a problem. I came here to do a job for you. I didn't have to. And I can still leave. Where shall I put my things? I'd prefer someplace dry if anything is available. The area near the life support plant on the crew deck tends to be slightly more arid than the rest of the ship. Ah, an AI. My thanks. He seems quite civil. Jacob. We need him, but that doesn't mean I trust him. Let me know if he turns into a problem. Aye, aye, Commander. Okay, so that will be my probably last really renegade action with Thane. Otherwise he <laughs> won't be a romance option, right? Okay, so... I'm gonna talk with the crew real quick, because there is an option that we maybe get... Um, at least one more um, uh, loyalty mission. Okay, yeah, we got the submachine gun because we found that thing. But that should be it, I think. Oh, yeah, oh, got piercing too. Oh. Okay, that should be it. Uh, let's talk to Morin. Still need to get to Chuchanka, Shepard. Oh yeah, we have being held by blood pack. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I'll he, talk he to you won't. Later, he we'll won't really talk to me. me. Uh, Jacob won't talk to me either because we have his loyalty quest already active. So let's talk with Joker real quick, and then if we really get another loyalty mission, I'm probably Kelly's making us aware of it. Another dangerous alien aboard, Commander. Thanks. Why can't you collect coins or commemorative plates or something? I assume everything's going well up here? Good for now. Fractured my thumb on the mute, but I think I made my point. That's it for now. See you, Commander. I think he's done with his uh, comments, I think, when he when he starts with uh, using the, the thumb line. I'm surprised by Thane's spiritual side. His psych profile mentioned little of it, and he carries himself with such cold confidence. I'm not sure if I find him scary or sexy. Maybe both. A lot of women like bad boys. A lot of women like you? On occasion. I live a dangerous life. Dangerous men fit right in. I like you more and more each day, Shepard. Anyway, 
How may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages okay. at the private terminal. Grunt seems very anxious, pacing down in the cargo hold. You might want to check in on him. Anything else, Commander? That'll so that's all. good I'll be that we get uh, Grant's mission too, because then we can Commander, do both on. A new message at your private terminal. Thank you. So that we can do both of them on Tuchanka. That would be nice. Uh, I'm not sure if we get teleported back up on the ship after one quest, but doesn't really matter, right? Burns, Martin, thank you again. Martin Burns. Quanta Shepard, Udina said this would reach you. I wanted you to know that I haven't forgotten what you did for me the day, uh, the day those crazy products took me off the show. That's from Mass Effect 1. Okay. You talked them down and you got me off the chip alive. I won't lie to you. I took this job for the pull and the power. I saw the biotics issue as a stepping stone, something good to put on my resume, and I was wrong. We all serve humanity in our own way. I don't know what you're doing, but I'm going to see to it that humanity reaches potential with a minimum of bloodshed. I'm getting letters of thanks from L2 Biotics, who just received their reparations. Those letters should really be coming to you. I just thought you should know. Uh, Kaden is also an L2, so... Uh, good luck. Uh, I've taken some political heat, so I don't know that any offer to help you would ever be useful. But if you need me, I won't let you down. Martin Burns. Lauren Keen, that's also Mass Effect 1. I think it's, yeah, it's the, the Turian from Novaria. Commander Shepard, I've come to have a lot of balls in flight. What? I've come to have a lot of balls in flight. As a human, <laughs> uh, yeah, he's always misinterpreting that. It was brought to my attention that you're still around working on something secret. Frankly, I hope that whatever you do keeps you far away from the very this time. But if you must come back, and what is it? Upset the fruit cart. <laughs> Let me know. And I'll clear a path for you for old time's sake. A pleasure as always, Lauren King. So I'm not sure. I think one of the mods is adding more uh, narrative, I think. Or more emails. Uh, I like it, though. Kate Bowman. Uh, that's from... The asteroid in Mass Effect 1, I think. Shepard, I called in some favors and found out how to get to you and what you're working on. We've got a big celebration planned for the anniversary of you and the other saving Terra Nova. Yeah, that's the, that's the asteroid. Last year we added a memorial for you too. I guess it was premature, huh? I figure finding out who's attacking... I figure finding out who's attacking colonies is why you had to go undercover, so I won't invite you to come give a speech or anything. But I wanted you to know that all of us living on colonies are worried about what's happening in the terminal systems. And I'm really glad you're there to help. There's a lot of crazy military talk going around. I'm glad someone's there. Who's not going to take the easy way out? Thanks, kid boy. Alrighty. So, let's talk to everyone. This area of oh, the come on, really? Normandy's cargo deck. That's all for now. Logging you out, Shepard. Thinking about past missions. Got a minute. You might learn something. One time we were trying to clear out this gun nest outside a base on Vatar. Nothing we did even made a dent in that thing. Someone had the bright idea to kidnap a local girl, strap grenades on her, and make her go seduce the guy in the bunker. Terrible thing, I tell you. Well, she went up there, knocked on the door, and nothing. Grenades never went off. But the guy stopped shooting, and we snuck by. Never found out what happened. <laughs> Can't imagine. You smoke, Shepard? Don't. That stuff will kill you. You are a kid once. Weapons dealer. Probably half your age. Bastard smoked too close to a cache of explosives. Tossed a butt, blew himself sky high. That can happen, I guess. I should let you go. Sure. Talk more later, Shepard. Yep. Uh, let's talk to check. Oh, she won't talk with us because we have to go to Prague. Yeah. Never mind. Tali. Shepard, what can I do for you? Have you got time to talk? I really need to clean up this okay. engine. I'll let you work. Talk to you later. Gabby, you'd say the Normandy is a she, not a he, right? Of course.
course. And Normandy's the sweetest girl there is. And Edie's a she. Tally's definitely a she. What are you getting at, Kenneth? I'm just saying I'm feeling a wee bit threatened here. A lot of female energy, and I'm just one man. You're such a dick. Mm. See? Look where your mind went. I've got to watch out for myself. Oh, I like those two. Chambers said you're tearing up the place. Something wrong? Something is wrong, Shepard. I feel wrong. Tense. I just want to kill something. With my hands. More so than usual. Like it's not my choice. Like I just want to... I don't know. See? Why do that? What's wrong? I will not tolerate outbursts on my ship. Get a hold of yourself. I'm trying. When we're moving, fighting, there's no problem. But here, my blood makes noise. It's screaming. I've got no past to lead me. The tank gave nothing about itching plates and losing control. I want you in the infirmary. I can't have some Krogan disease running <laughs> rampant. Your doctors only see victims of Krogan. My kind do not share with aliens. Not after the genophage. We won't find someone who's seen this. A Krogan my age would still be on the homeworld, Tuchanka. And we go there. Joker can get us to the Krogan homeworld. I need everyone at their best. Thank you, Shepard. I don't like this. Fury is my choice, not a sickness. All right. Let's get to the crew quarters. I'm pretty sure that uh, Chakwas has nothing to say, but we can still talk to her, I guess. I just got a message from my wife. I've been listening to my daughter's giggle over and over. <laughs> That's so cute. When this mission is over, I'm gonna give her the longest hug she's ever had. Yep, still takes a while. I don't think. How are you? Perhaps we could yeah. speak later. I should go. Of course. I should. So this is Thane. Yeah, we can talk. Oh, no. It's not Thane. Uh, Thane should be here. Let's be nice. Do you need something? Have a few minutes to talk? Certainly. We haven't had a chance since I joined. When we met you, you said you were dying. Yes. I thought you'd want to know more. You don't have to worry about the rest of the crew. My illness is not communicable, even to other Drell. It's called Kepril Syndrome. Are you gonna be alright till the end of the mission? I should be fine for another 8 to 12 months. The more time I spend in human environments, the faster it progresses. I think it's safe to say that by the time my body is incapacitated, we'll be victorious. Or dead. Either way, I won't be a burden to you. What exactly is the problem? My people are native to an arid world. Most of us now live on Kaje, the Hanar homeworld. It's very humid and rains every day. Our lungs can't deal with the moisture. Over time, the tissue loses its ability to absorb oxygen. It becomes harder to breathe. Eventually, we suffocate. Uh, okay. <laughs> Are you going to be all right till the end of the mission? Oh, I should be fine for another eight right. to twelve months. I think it's safe to say that either way, I won't be. What exactly is the problem? My people are love. Eventually, Just want to have that option again. We suffocate. Can't they do something about that? The Hammer have funded a genetic engineering program. They should be able to adapt us. The project has only been running for a few years. I don't believe my body will still draw breath by the time it bears fruit. Oh, we can do both of it, I guess? So. Then don't live on Kaje. Or use breathers. Drell have a close relationship with the Hanar. We rely on each other. The best we can do is keep our homes very dry inside. Is there anything we can do here? Normandy has a state-of-the-art medical bay. No, thank you. It's being attended to. If the finest medical minds in the Hanar illuminated primacy can't solve the problem, 
I doubt your ship's medic could. Thank you for your concern. Trust me, this won't affect my performance. Do you need something? You mind if I ask you a few questions? Not at all. The Drell live on the Hanar homeworld, don't they? Yes. I know many think it just said difficult so. to understand. It's just that they're very formal with those they don't know. We know them quite well. If you ever get close enough to a Hanar that they tell you their soul name, you would find them warm. Hanar talk using bioluminescence. That's more of an obstacle than their politeness. True. Many Drell have had their eyes genetically modified to perceive their higher frequency flashes. I had the treatment. I can't tell the difference between a dark red and black, but I can see ultraviolet light as a silver color. Cool. I thought that Hanar only let very close friends know their soul name. Most of my commissions were for Hanar. I grew close to my regular contacts. Soul names tend to be poetic. A Hanar known for its cynicism might take a name that means illuminates the folly of the dancers. When you pray for the wicked, who exactly are you praying to? That depends on the circumstance. To find my target, I speak with Emonkira, Lord of Hunters. When I act to defend another, Arashu, goddess of motherhood and protection. And when I have taken my target, I speak with Kalahira, goddess of oceans and the afterlife. Yeah, we'll talk to Kalahira in Mass Effect 3, definitely. Oceans and afterlife don't seem to have much in common. Consider, the ocean is full of life. Yet it is not life as you and I know it. To survive there, we must release our hold on land. Accept a new way to live. So it is with the death. The soul must accept its departure from the body. If it can't, it will be lost. I didn't know that Drell had many gods. It's one of our older beliefs. Many embrace the Hanar and Kindlers now. Or the Asari philosophies. The old ways are dying. There are so many ways to interpret one's place in the universe. Who needs the wisdom of our ancestors? The younger generations don't believe they can help us fathom genetic engineering, orbital strikes, or alien races. Funny thing, uh, both the Kindlers and the Asari uh, are praying to the Protheans, if you, uh, if you know what's happening in Mass Effect 3. Uh, at least, uh, in Kindlers, they know that the Protheans are the collector. Or, um, they don't know it yet, but uh, the in Kindlers are the Protheans, and the uh, Sari have their philosophies or whatever. But uh, as we know in Mass Effect Three, the the Protheans really uh, help the Sari, and and the gods basically are or. At least the old doctrine from the Asari, the gods, are uh, actually Protheans, so... That's... Interesting that he mentions those two religions that both have the Protheans. Protheans. We need to have the best equipment possible to take on the Collectors. You have any leads I could chase down? My old contact network often located rare equipment for me. Would you like me to get in touch with them? No. Yes. Let's see what they've got. Uh, we got more probes. Okay, that's that's fine. Not sure if we can talk more with him. I think we have to do at least one mission. Do you need something? Have a few minutes to talk. Later. Yeah. I'd like to cons. I should go. I shall return to my meditations. Okay, so... Oh, what's wrong one? Uh, Kasumi is probably repeating the same stuff again, but let's talk with her a little bit. There you are. I have to say, that Jacob? Mm hmm. He seems pretty intense. I wonder if he likes Japanese girls with a pension for kleptomania. Joker and Edie are like an old okay, married yeah, couple. Maybe we heard that one. I keep expecting to walk in on them bickering about the <clears> temperature <throat> in the cockpit. Edie has a wicked sense of humor. Or I should say, a really funny lack of one. Sometimes she seems like a person. But when it comes down to it, I can't get past her being a computer. Come back later. I'm sure I'll have more to talk about. I'm sure you do. Alright. There's probably some banter here. Yes, no, maybe. 
Okay. And I don't think that she has something to say. Yeah. I'll see you later. Commander. So one of those things is, yeah, heal scars those. We can do that uh, once we've reached maximum, or at least before we do the final mission, that's for sure. So we don't... We can't talk to Miranda because we have her quest, and I think we can't talk to Garrus because he is doing his calibrations. Shepard, need me for something? Have you got a minute? Can it wait for yep. a bit? Um, I'll be here if you need me. Yep, yep. Okay. So we should be done for this episode. Uh, I'm gonna go back to my quarters and change to another casual gear. Because we got so much. And... Uh, I'm not sure, maybe I'll do some planet scanning uh, off, off recording, uh, without recording. Uh, but, I mean, it doesn't really take that long now because we don't need that many probes, so I might keep it in the video. Also, like a high quality photo of the arrow there. Um, dum 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 dum. Let's see. We could go with the N7 hoodie. So, uh, again, thanks for watching, everyone. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe if you like my content. And maybe post a comment if you want. And I hope we'll see you again in the next one. When I will probably do planet scanning first. And then... I guess go to Chuchanka. Uh, because I have to get the, the gear and stuff from there anyways. So, till then, have fun and bye-bye.